Hi guys, welcome to the next section of the course, Monitoring and Troubleshooting Azure Serverless Services. Azure provides us with multiple tools to achieve all the monitoring requirements right from the development stage and the maintenance stage of the application. In this section, we will learn how to utilize this information and take necessary actions based on the information available. Now we move on to the first video of this section that deals with monitoring your Azure functions. In this video, we will learn about individual function logs and then in the later part of the video, we will discover about all functions of a given function app. Let's navigate to the Azure function solution. We'll switch to the platform features of the function app and click on Diagnostic Logs Blade. In the Logs Blade, enable Application Logging File system by clicking on the On button if it is off, and then click on Save to save the changes. We can see the notification popped up saying Successfully Updated Web App Log Settings. Later on, close the Log Blade. After that, we will navigate to the Code Editor in the Azure Management Portal of any Azure function. From the Function App Blade, we will open the Register User function. Here, we will notice a bar at the bottom with the title as Logs. Click on the bar to expand it. After expanding, it should look like this, where we can view all the logs that show the events that happen after opening it. Let's navigate to Monitor tab to view all the past events that happened with the Azure function. This is the list of events that happened in the register user function that we created in our previous sections. In the invocation blog list, we will click on any of the log items for which the status is a success. Here, we will see all the request and binding details of the particular event that happened with this function. Now let's click on any of the log item for which the status column indicates failure. We will see the request and binding details along with a special field named failure that provides details about the reason for the failure. As we can observe on the screen, the detailed error details are available in the log section. In order to view live data of the events, navigate to the Platform Features tab of the Function app and we will click on Log Streaming. After clicking on the Log Streaming link, it will take us to the Streaming Logs window where we can view all the events happening in all the functions of the selected Function app. In this video, we monitored Azure Functions along with individual Function Logs and Log Streaming. 